Hi, right. uh, it's video time. Um, let's get the phone plugged in. Uh, so after lull, the targeting is almost as bad as it was before the holiday. Not quite, but the increasing the noise campaign again. The uh, same tactics, use of repetitive sirens, cars revving, etc. Good chemtrail footage, which I want to show you. Uh, so, yeah. In the plain sight. Yeah, they are. <laughs> if you can hear that. Hear that? Just the moment I start. Hear that? Sirens. I hope you can hear that. So, you know what I'm, what I'm gonna do. Um, why is this not showing up? There we go. They know what I'm gonna do, so they're not happy. Uh, oh, yeah, wrong folder. So, let's get this. Uh, I'll try to figure out. We'll just go back in time. That's the easiest way. Then I can. Yeah, the sirens. <laughs> yeah, they're not gonna. I'm not gonna let them disrupt me. So we'll start with this. This is the chemtrails. They're they're not, they're not happy. You know been targeting them back in my own way not stopping even now so this evening day, loads day, of chemtrails day, especially today and this isn't even the best footage trail yeah. across the sky that's a bird so we've got a... let's play this for you So yeah, I mean, <laughs> check this out. This is that cat, yeah, that I mentioned, and this is the cat I was trying to tell you about. Weird behaviour again. The cat doesn't live here. That's I've that never cat. seen this cat before. Now all of a sudden, it's turning up at my doorstep. Now, the thing, the thing just come to my door, like trying to get in, looking like trying see. to get in. You know what I mean? Uh, see, see, here it comes. This is the cat where when I fall, I did mind controlling the cat. I got a car honking. Right? Yeah. So, yeah. The same one that was staring at me blank. It's made that more, though. X marks the spot, country. There, there, and there. This is the bombardment of the sky. It's not playing. Not there we go. Down there as well. Just get it. Try and get it in focus. Can't really see it, but this one. Yeah, the car's running. Just there. It gets in focus eventually. There. So it's three of them. Blanket. Blanketed. Deliberate, look at that. <sighs> Put 
playing games with this shit now. Look at that. Look at the cross. X marks the spot. Fuckers, man. They like to do that where TIs are. Not just where TIs, but they seem to like to do it where TIs are. Probably part of the psyops. Flying down here. Plane. Still going on faintly. Is it the sirens? Only in the last two days it's been like this. It's like someone's flipped a switch. It was quiet. There was no cars revving. There was no sirens. No. They decide to do the psyop. And now there's sirens and cars. Yeah, you quiet. can just hear it. That's how you know it's delivered. Seems like they're not bothering with the uh, sneaky stuff anymore. They're just trying the most campaign. <laughs> Playing games now. I did not close that. No, this just closed down by itself. Right, that was that one. Come the siren horns. This time, this <laughs> yeah. you know this is because I said so. I did a Google search that they didn't like. Yeah, and it started up just after I did it. This is their little strop about that. <laughs> you know, having a little strop hissy fit, aren't you, girls? So I start calling, and I, I, I like been t t when they start targeting me, I'm like, it's doing a Google search saying, "Why are you misbehaving, girls?" <laughs> so they've been misbehaving. They've been being bad girls and misbehaving. Bitches. But, you know, they, this is how they do. To uh, they go again. They try to force you their will on you. If you say something they don't like, then they'll do this. But it'll never make me think you're like you. So I don't know why you bother. I'm laughing at you fools. Literally, <laughs> I'm laughing at you motherfuckers because you're not you're not changing who I am. Cocksucker. In one way. Yeah, bitch. Thing. More the same. Coupled with the oh, cars. Yeah, it's starting up with a noise campaign again. Sirens, cars revving, the whole lot. Yeah. Yeah. Last two days, starting. Yeah, last two days it's been going. Fools are honking like crazy, man. It's like, if it ain't the sirens, it's the honking. 
Yeah. These, these fucking panic, fucking ponce cucks, you know what I mean? Cocksuckers, you know, they'll, they'll do whatever it takes to try and harass you. But guess what? I'm still here, motherfucker. Yeah. Bitch. <laughs> yeah, you got to make yourself laugh, you know what I mean? Faggots. You know what I mean? Well, folks are vexed, man. You know, because I, I just did a Google search saying, you know, the riots in London area are a good thing. You know. Yeah, Ireland. You know, get get this government out of your country, Ireland. You don't want it. They're fucking scum. You know. I don't want said, it. Actually, I'm not going to say because they probably say it's a terrorist act, but <laughs> I just let's just say I said something which is controversial but true. And they are not happy about that. <laughs> yeah, it makes me laugh, man. I just seen a comment about Prince Charles, yeah, saying we need to stop, you know, knife crime. It's like that's coming from the family that's killed more motherfuckers than probably any other family in the UK. So <laughs> Yeah, that's seriously coming from the royal family. Pretty joking, man. It's their own fault for this. The, the people like that have caused this. Looking like Notre Dame was an inside job. Yeah, here we go. Um, basically, someone got a video of a um, webcam, and you could see an uh, unidentified object appear. And then shortly after that, the uh, fire began. Also, um, it was predicted in The Simpsons. Yeah, which it is, was as well. As you'll know if you're into this stuff, has predicted a lot of things, like, such as 9 11, Bush being president, etc. Uh, not Bush, sorry, um, Trump being president, etc. So, um, yeah, they do this. And then, uh, I believe it was uh, possibly energy weapons, uh, namely the TR3B. Or similar craft, which, if you don't know what that is, it's basically uh, top secret US military, probably NATO as well, triangular craft that uses nuclear power and some kind of anti gravity uh, drive as well. With some people have said they have cloaking technology and stay plus weapons. I heard it have particle weapons, um, which is. Basically, I think what I've heard stories of them being tested in a, in the Iraq War, um, basically melting vehicles and stuff like that. So about that, I just heard them making noise, and I've been listening to a rapper called Big Burner, and he calls them staplers. I think it's a funny thing to say. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it means, but it's negative. So that's what these motherfuckers are. Everything negative is what these motherfuckers are. Just like in California, with the fo forest fires, how they started that with lasers. Shit, like go in my head. Uh, it seems they are destroying buildings now with them. Right I, now. I shouldn't have said that, because I, I, I forgot it was recording as well, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, oh, yeah. video, you know, there's even patents for this anti-gravity technology using an ele electromagnetic field. I did find it once. Um, as for the cloaking... You know, that's technically possible. Uh, there's two ways yeah. to do it: warp light around the object, or have cameras on them. Min lots of miniature cameras and lots of miniature LEDs on the object. Basically, like a big TV screen thing. So it displays what the camera sees on one side, on one side, and what it sees on the other. That's another way of cloaking. So this technology is real. Um, the energy weapons, as you know, is real. Uh, there's lasers that exist that aren't even classified but are mounted on 
ships. They've mounted them on Apache gunships that can uh, burn things, destroy things. So, you know, this shit is real. Got a few videos from yesterday as well. Just get this up. Yo, check this out. So, the neighbors, yeah, the ones that I suspect are involved in the targeting. Oh, yeah, this happened the other day. They have had a dog. No, this happened today on that bullshit again, that Tilly bullshit. For about three months, because when I moved here, there was no. If you follow my channel for a while, you'll know what I mean. Dog. Come to find out what the name of the dog is with the woman saying its name and. Guess what name the dog is? If you follow my channel for a while, you'll remember they were saying a certain dog's name around me. Not my. They've also said my family's dog's name, but a certain one beginning with T. Yeah. So for those that are new to my channel, the I've been constantly having people going past me, saying, "Come on, Tilly. Come on, Murphy. Come on, Tilly." All right. And it started off in West West House where I lived in Sheffield. I'd have someone coming outside my flat, constantly saying Tilly, Murphy, like that, you know what I mean? And then it continued, I'd have people coming around me with dogs saying, Come on Tilly, come on Tilly. You know? It's some kind of it could be the nickname they've tried to give me, because I know from reading a book that MI five nickname their targets. Okay, the people that are surveilling, they nickname them. So, yeah, this woman again, you know, says, come on, Tilly. Yeah, uh, th this is, this is what they do, you know. I've been constantly having people with dogs saying, come on, Tilly, come on, Tilly, you know. That name, Tilly, it just keeps popping up. Right, and I know it's part of the target because I went past someone actually today, and they said my family's dog's name, which is Alfie, as well. I mean, it's a common dog name, so possibly a coincidence. But they they were deliberately doing that around the time my family got the dog in Sheffield. There's people saying Alfie to the dog around me, so yeah. It's been it's been going on for years. Like I've constantly been having, and it's not a popular dog's name too. It's not. You know, I've been having people constantly saying Tilly and Murphy around me, okay? Constantly saying Tilly and Murphy. Even had some people walk past her and say, oh, you know, I'm, I'm seeing Tilly, I'm seeing Murphy, or something like that. So it's, it's some kind of code word to do with me and my targeting that is being used to uh, harass me. Because these, these people... I think they're leaving soon because there's a for sale sign on the. Oh, the noise has just stopped. I guess all that noise was because through the remote and all monitoring. Uh, and when I woke today, there were sirens again. You know, they monitor you that much. As soon as I woke, sirens. Right? So they probably know now, oh, shit, you know, he's not going to stop. So that was like their way to try and stop me making a video. But that just made me want... I wasn't actually going to make the video tonight, but that just made me want to make the video even more. Um, it's the building in front of my house, and it's full of perps. I, I keep seeing new people arriving all the time that I've not seen before, um, which is something you'll notice is a TI. Yeah, and it's for sale. They haven't been coming in next door again, but they were. They were using that house to target me, and, they, and that's for sale. No, no one's bought it yet. Yeah, this Tilly thing is something they've been using. So if I sound a bit weird, I've got a cold again. Um, they've been chemtrading very heavily again today. Uh, Just don't know. Better than yesterday, which was awful. It was hazy. You could hardly see the sun. 
somewhat of a blue sky. I'll not to show you because it's charging. But um, yeah, this Tilly thing. Specifically, Tilly and Murphy are two words they use around me when they have dogs. Showing you the mess. This is this morning. A bit clearer than yesterday. More the same this morning. <laughs> see, you can see how constant this is. Shit all day, aren't you? Lost the side. This might have been yesterday, actually, I think, because it's more hate. Yeah, this was yesterday, but same shit again. And it's not a city I live in. So you can't say, oh, yeah, it's because you live in a city. You know what I mean? Just show you the repetitiveness. This is the so-called sunny day we've had. Yesterday was worse for the trails. Look at that. The messed up sky. We've been spraying all day. Come up there, you can just see it there in the sky. See it there. Yeah. Just the world we're living in at the moment. Sunny days are rarely a genuine one because this isn't a genuine one. Even though the sun is there, it's shrouded in this pollution. As you can see. Yeah, you know, yesterday was just bullshit. Yeah, it was you know. a sunny day, just like they said, and not haze, chemtrails. I see them spraying pollution. This is the kind of sun you've got. Hey. Right. Like hell on earth yesterday, man. This is the haze, pollution, and shit. You know, yeah, to that motherfucker last year in the autumn that was trying to diss me, saying I was a bin diver and shit. But this is basically because I got a stereo out of a um, skip. Guess what, motherfucker? The shit. It the works. Stereo, yeah? It works fucking fine, and the speakers work fine. So you can diss me all you want, cocksuckers, but I got a free stereo, motherfucker. Wooden. Wooden Hitachi speakers, the whole shit. So, you can call me a bin diver for that all you want, but I saved a perfectly fine stereo, motherfucker. Bitch. <laughs> I'll just flood let you know right now. They're sacrificing people like crazy, man. Yeah. I mean, I've just seen someone from... I've never heard of them, but Panny and... A lot of celebrities dying right now. She's popped to clogs now. That guy from the... the singer from The Prodigy, he died. His... Some bandmate died. Not Prodigy the Rapper. The, the, there's a group called Prodigy, although I think Prodigy the Rapper was also killed by these people. But this is a... Uh, drum and bass band called The Prodigy. So someone else as well popped the clogs recently, which uh, I can't remember. But there's lots of celebrities right now dying. You know what I mean? And I come to find out as well that this is a ritual time of year, something to do with some sat satanic ritual. Um, Notre Dame got yeah. burnt on a ritualistic day. Notre Dame Cathedral caught fire. That um, was on a ritualistic day. So they're killing a lot of celebrities right now. 
This is the moon at night, and it looked brown with the pollution. I shit you not. Another guy filmed the moon at night as well. I wasn't copying him. I, I did this before I saw his video. It was that guy in Manchester that exposes chemtrails a lot. Can't remember his name. Alan something. Remember. But the shit was brown. I don't show it well, but the the moon looked brown. Light it was giving off was brown. see it with my eyes but you see that orangey colour to it this shit is real man you know what I mean I'm gonna try and show you guys if I can I don't know if it'll pick it out too well but it's really really misty out there and it's not mist that that's that's smog there's that brown you see the brownness so that's a street fan oh, that's a lie <laughs> but yeah, it looked more in my eyes. Being healthy and everything right now. But believe me, man, the sun looks, the moon looks way more orange and it looks brown, man. It's, it's like I've never seen it like this before. It's giving it, it's like a brown color. Brownie white, I suppose. It's got like a brown colour, the, the camera is not picking it out well. Really, really. The sun has got like a brown colour. Moon. I pull that down to the weed I smelled the other day. The moon has got like a brown <laughs> colour. But yeah, I'm just about to go to bed, I've just seen that. I'm going to call up now, I'm not sure. Siren Horse just made a, made a video. Yeah, so there's a continue. That's what I've been calling them. Because a siren is like a whore, you know what I mean? Like a mythological thing. I'm going to call up now, I'm not sure. I've got some audio recordings as well, which I will play after this. Oh no, call. So that, you know, that one, that was the. That was me, you know, waiting. I've already played that. So we'll go straight to the sound recordings. Everything's backward on this phone. It's like everything's where you should, don't expect it to be. Like videos are in pictures, sound recordings are in documents. It's like, it doesn't make sense. Big John, oh, that was a song I wanted to sample to remind myself. I thought it that uh, um anyway. Come again. <laughs> what do you mean you can't play? There you go again, you know, sabotage and shit. So we found out the real Oh, you're going to decide to play now. Reason why they burn Notre Dame down. I won't be talking about this. I'm telling you now, actually, when I start talking about this and the recording, the talking stepped up a lot. They don't want me speaking about this shit. Down. Just says it in this article. It says something like Macron will be looking. Play from the beginning because some got caught out. Reason why they burn Notre Dame down. Just says it in this article. It says. Something like Macron will be looking to see this as a way to have it as his legacy and uh, and to push past the divisive yellow vest pro uh, protest. There you go, right? They probably did that as a distraction to try and bring people together, you know, because Macron is. I think they were going to do it anyway because it was in predictive programming. Uh, president, I think, not prime minister, I think they call him president. Um, 
So, you know, this is just a distraction tactic. They did the same thing in not distraction tactic, but it's a manipulation to basically try and bring um, sorry about the noise to try and bring the France together just like when when that we were having the Brexit vote they I'm not even sure she died I mean there's, there's evidence to show that she didn't even die that I've seen you know okay I'll, I'll basically let me explain um, the person that was doing the uh, this is that Joe Cox I think her name is person that was doing the um, post-mortem like the, in the white suits looked like her her dad and also it was an elderly man now I, there's this guy explaining it I can't remember the video was probably been scrubbed but he was talking about the fact that people in that profession are not old you know they don't hire people that age and also it was comparing similarities between her and her sister looking the same. So I don't think she died. I think she's still alive. I think they just did that as a sale. That's what I think. Um, I can never remember a damn name. Joe, Joe something, that MP that got killed, supposedly. You know, basically... That was around the time of Brexit votes and all that. So, you know, they, they probably did that to try and turn... But they basically did that to try and make people who want Brexit look like extremists and all this kind of stuff. So, that's the kind of stuff they like to do, you know. They, the distraction tactics, the manipulation. Uh, so, I'm... Um, Fred. Fred just caught on my hand on my trousers and all that what the fuck. So, you know, they're going to use this as a way to make Macron look like an amazing person and all this. It's been a classic tactic. Manipulation and, and stuff. Just getting a knife to cut this thread off my trousers. There's a massive thread just come out of nowhere. Crap trousers. I've only worn them a few times and they're starting to get a hole in it already. Yeah, it's got a hole in it already. Like. Yeah, man, I mean, it's so predictable. If there's one, one of these fools' biggest weakness is they are predictable. Just like in Christchurch. Go straight to the guns, yeah. Sorry, that showed the number 32 when I was there. Uh, Lowering the volume, that, that the guns. coincidental. Yeah. That. I'm sorry about that. An excuse to take the guns. Political agenda comes after the event, and if they haven't set the event up, they'll use the event as a way to get their agenda through. Just like what they did with Sandy Hook. Yeah, I think as soon as that shit happened in Christchurch, they were like, "Oh, we need to ban the guns." Typical shit. Which was a false flag terrorist attack. Manchester bombing. It was not a bombing. As well to spread fear. I could like prove it wasn't a bombing. Yeah. They scrubbed pretty much all the videos exposing that off the internet, off YouTube. If you search, you will hardly find it. You know, they, they really went to town on that and scrubbed it, but it's so oh. fake, you know what I mean? No footage of anyone injured. Crash attackers. Um, they played the explosion through the loudspeakers. It's ridiculous. Not only that, when I <laughs> when I um, exposed this, 
I was on the bus and I saw someone in coming. I was going from through Chesterfield to Sheffield. And I saw a woman on the bus that looked as they looked just like one of the people that I saw on TV talking about her friend who died. I'm I'm pretty certain it was the same person. It looked like them. I was like, whoa, <laughs> these this shit's crazy. You know, knowing these people, I wouldn't be surprised if it was. I would not be surprised if it was. Damn, that was a false, wasn't even a false fight, it was a fake attack. It was a fake, purely psyop, psychological operation. What? But I don't care what no one says. A lot of these ones in London as well. And you know why they haven't been in attack in a while? It's because they were getting exposed to, to hell. Yeah, them revving. Exposed. Themselves making some stupid mistakes. That was the biggest mistake they made in Manchester was not letting the fire service attend. This is the real one. They stopped the fire service getting to the attack. Now tell me, there's been a bomb, right? Bombs have flames, right? What is the best emergency service that is going to attend? Right. Use your head. It's not the ambulance. It's the fire service. So you're telling me you're going to stop the fire service from getting in? You know why? Because they would have seen there was nothing going on. That's why. That's why they stopped them going in. The corrupt police and corrupt members of the emergency services. NHS. When they know, the fire service were in the know. Not all of them. So they kept them out. So they won't find out it was fake. Contain it. Right? Like, don't, just, don't ever believe that crap about the Manchester bombing. It was fake as fuck. Don't ever believe that shit was real. No, but this Notre Dame thing, they burned that down. They burned it down. Make no mistake about it. They burned it down. Most definitely. No question about it. They, they predicted before it even happened. It was in the Simpsons with Notre Dame burning down. That's how they do it. They've done it with other things, too. They've done it with all kinds of things. So, don't, now, don't ever believe these fools. When they say one thing, they probably mean another. If they say terrorists did it, they probably did it. If they say they did it, terrorists probably did it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? So yeah, don't don't believe. Don't the believe the hype. These people are the biggest terrorists. The governments that control the people and um, through fear, coercive persuasion, whatever mind control. They're the biggest terrorists on the face of this earth. Try to terrorize me every day. They try to terrorize me with this harassment every day. The gang stalking, the, you know, psychological tactics used are designed to terrorize you, designed to have you in fear. Okay? So who's the fucking terrorist, yeah? Who's the motherfucking terrorist? I think you motherfuckers in the government are. Yeah? fucking terrorist going, the fucking MI5 and MI6, the biggest fucking terrorist, the CIA, GCHQ, FBI, they're the biggest terrorist going, and then they got the nerve to like, try to accuse people of being terrorists that aren't, probably say I'm a terrorist, you know what I mean, because I don't support the government, that means I'm a terrorist. I don't like the government or the police. That means I'm a terrorist, right? It means I'm an extremist. Because I don't trust the government. Because I don't like them. That makes you a terrorist these days. But then they're the, they're the ones who are really committing the terrorist attacks. You know? That's a long, long history of it. 
goes back on the long side. Goes back to 9-11. It goes back to 9 9-11 was the biggest. So I'm just speaking so y'all don't just play it here. 9-11 was the biggest false flag terrorist attack ever. These fires, these fires in California, they were terrorist attacks that we just had. They set them. The government set those fires with the weapons they have, the direct energy weapons. There's footage of trees burning from the inside out. There's blue rays, blue flashes that have been seen. Governments are the biggest terrorist threats. Run out of space, so recording will more the science shit. Voice. As you can hear, we still got their hissy fit going. I don't say they didn't like <laughs> what I said, so you can hear driving past. And the cars revving. This is because they're not happy. This is how they respond. So <laughs> these faggots, man, they make me laugh because it's like if if you let me know something I've searched or whatever is not that you don't like it by targeting me with a siren, I'm gonna do it more. Okay, all you're doing is letting me know that it's getting to you. So, guess what? I'm gonna do it more, perps. I'm gonna do it more. I'm just coming inside because it is ridiculously hot today, man. It must be like 22 degrees. So, yeah, these motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> they're next. They're next again. They, they, they don't learn. They don't learn. Like, they, they do the same thing. Sorry about the noise. Man, that's how stupid these fools are. They do the same thing again and again and again and again. And I didn't realise it'd be that noise. Yeah, I'm getting a drink. The like. silent horse. The rev horse and the honk horse. So that's what I'm calling them. I'm calling them a horse from now on. Yeah, they Right as well. Getting pop-ups. <laughs> yeah, I've been getting these pop-ups for about a week now. It keeps fucking popping up and I can't get rid of it. But I'm uninstalling Windows eventually, very soon. But I keep getting these fucking pop-ups. Asian women and all kinds of bullshit. There they come again, see. <laughs> that's a fire engine or something <laughs> fucking idiots man that's just because I did a <laughs> like say to me don't you do that James you have no authority over me only God does you have no authority over me no I'm only a servant to God. Revving the cars outside here too. <laughs> a servant to man. You have no authority over me whatsoever. No jurisdiction. I'll say what I want. I'll do what I want. You can't stop me. You won't stop me. 
you will not take people's freedom of speech. You just won't. You bastards are finished. It's over. You'll never get peace in Northern Ireland, neither. I can I condone them. Yeah. For resisting you. I don't condone the terrorism, but I condone them for resisting you. You bastards. I can see why they hate you. Because if you're doing this to them, like you're doing it to me, I can see why people in Ireland hate you. Why they don't like you. And they have every right to hate you. So even though they got another siren coming now. Like basically, I did a search about this in Northern Ireland, and that, that really pissed them off. I mean, it really pissed them off. But they, they started with this targeting and noise campaign pretty much two minutes after I did this. <laughs> it's coming to an end. You're losing control. You're scared. You're scared, aren't you? You're losing control of the streets, and you know it. Listen to them. They're vexed. Listen. So can hear it. <laughs> You've already lost control of the youth. The, not that I condone the senseless violence going on with the knives, but you lost control. You don't have control of them. They're fucks. They they fucking out. They don't care about you. It's a shame, but you made you made this problem. You made you treated youth so bad. They don't care. They don't give a fuck about you. They don't give a fuck about no one. And I nearly ended up like that too. So you, you motherfuckers, man. You don't learn, do you? You don't. You don't learn. You don't learn from your mistakes. You just keep doing them, and then you get the same result, just like this program. You fuck with people, they fuck with you. They don't give a fuck about you. Do you think these kids on the street give a fuck about Theresa May? And fucking Prince Charles? They don't give a fuck about you. They don't give a fuck about voting. All they care about is the material things that you brainwash them to do. So you'll reap what you sow. Now you're thinking, aren't you, bitch? Now you're thinking, like, oh shit. You didn't think of that, did you? You didn't think of that, did you, bitch? That they, they, you, you thought brainwashing people to not give a fuck about anything but material things? That means they don't care about you neither. So if you get shanked, or shot, or beat down, they don't give a fuck about you. Yeah, because you brainwashed them to do that shit. See, see how it works against you? Yeah. Now the sirens have stopped because you're thinking. I know you're listening. You're like, yeah, I don't like what he's saying, so I'm going to play the sirens. Let him know I don't like what he's saying. I'm going to honk my horns. But what does it achieve? Nothing. Has it stopped me exposing you? No. I wasn't going to make a video today, actually, but you're making me want to now. <laughs> You've actually made me want to make a video now. You've actually made me want to do that shit now. But yeah, there's riots going on in Northern Ireland again. God bless them. Shame, I don't condone them shooting that journalist. That's wrong, but they reap what they sow, don't they? They're the cause of it. I don't think we should be in Ireland. I don't know what anyone thinks about that. This government needs to get the fuck out of Ireland. Guess it needs to get the fuck out of the UK as well, this government does. I used to get the fuck out of Ireland and the UK. I'm, well, I'm not calling it the gal Britain. Because that's what it should be called, not the UK. Because that's their shit. The United Kingdom is their shit. The United Kingdom needs to get the fuck out of Britain. I mean, just like the EU. The EU needs to get the fuck out of Britain too. No, no I'm not hating on Europeans. I'm hating on the EU. Because the EU is corrupt control organization these bastards want to censor motherfuckers they want to put trackers in motherfuckers cars research it the eu wants to do that they want to have control of your car they want to limit your car <laughs> posting music up and sensing your internet yeah but that new bill that they brought in is the 
spawn of the USA, which is why the USA is so fucked up, because it's the spawn of the UK. All your laws and jurisdictions came from the UK, mostly. Even the right to bear arms was in the UK law, originally, which is not a bad thing. You know, we should be able to own whatever we want, but... Um, all the evil from the UK went to the US as well. All these Freemasons, all these occultists. The Freemasons began in, in Britain. You know, they're an offspring of Britain. But you know, it is. They, they, they strop it, man. It's like. You hear them revving the cars? I've got the ice cream man as well. I'm not saying that. So clowns. So childish. So pathetic. It's unbelievably pathetic. Yeah, I'm going to say what I want. I'm going to do what I want and say what I want. Those tricks ain't going to stop me. I'm saying what I want. You can honk, Simon, Simon Hall, pimp yourself out with your ambulance. Or you, can <laughs> rev your cars till, you can rev your cars till you burn that shit out. It's not going to stop me talking about what I want to talk about. It's not going to stop me talking about this program. It's not going to change my opinion. It's in fact, it's solidifying it on world matters. Clowns are it's, it's crumbling. It's crumbling from under your feet. We're losing control. Yeah, I take it. You really think you're gonna take control through chaos? <laughs> Fuck you, motherfuckers, on man. You you really think that? You really think you'll get older out of chaos? Is that what you fucking think? I don't fucking think so. All you'll get out of chaos is chaos. Right? You put ice to ice, it's gonna be ice. It's not gonna get hot, is it? Put fire to fire, it's not gonna get cold, is it? It's gonna be fire. That's how retarded you motherfuckers are, man. The funniest thing is they think they're smart. They think they're smart and intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just laughing just to let it. You know what I mean? It just makes me laugh that they actually think they're smart. No, it's funny. Still at it. <laughs> you know they actually do oh, think man. that. That's the funny thing. They actually think that, you know. <laughs> Pricks. <laughs> Dickhead. This. Apart from wasting your time and fuel. Nothing. You get a laugh out of it. Literally. Bitch, I literally am laughing at you fools. I'm not tripping because of it, I'm not mad. <laughs> I'm not scared of you. I'm doing my thing, I'm going out. I'm not giving a fuck about you. Doing living my life, I'm not giving a fuck about you. I'm aware of you, but I have to be, you know what I mean? I have to be on point, but I don't give a fuck about you. I don't respect you. I'm not scared of you. You're the punk then as well. I don't give a fuck about you. That's not me sniffing coke, that's because I've got a cold. You know, it sounds like it. But i got a cold. Like, what the fuck with me, man? You're going to stop nothing, man. Not by this shit, anyway. Mm. 
so I'm not doing that to target anyone. I'm thinking it's something to say. Sometimes I do that. I shouldn't have done that. Sorry. Um, but yeah. These people, man. They are the stupidest people you can imagine. And they do this shit. Like, for real. They're just uh, silent now. You know. Let me just listen to. Have to listen. You know. Oh shit. It's not bothering. Me. Fuck about you people, man. Sorry. Real fuck about you. Vroom, vroom. All you want. Doesn't make a difference, does it? <laughs> Fucking ass wipes. And how these motherfuckers, man, being very. Subtle, oh, I've already played that, okay. So yeah, that, that gives you an idea of what these fools have been doing and, you know, noise campaign and all the rest. Hope you enjoyed that video, I know I did. <laughs>